I'm John Wilcox, field demonstrator for Laminated Wood Systems. One of the most frequently asked questions on the ELAM engineered wood pole is can they be climbed using conventional hooks and lineman's tools? Can they be drilled and can attachments be added after the pole has been installed? Today we're going to do a very, very simple demonstration. We're going to work about midpoint up on the pole so that you can hear me. Uh, we're going to mount a simple eye bolt just to show you that the poles can be drilled, attachments can be added after the installation is finished. As you can see, I'm walking the corner and working on the corner of the pole. On the larger poles, the unguide angle poles, obviously they get fatter at the butt. This will probably eliminate the opportunity to hitchhike at the bottom of the pole. You may have to hand over hand until you get into the work area. Once you're into the work area, the pole becomes dimensionally smaller and you're able to use your standard safety strap and body belt. One of the other issues that, uh, that comes up uh, every time about the ELAM engineered pole is climbing them with conventional hooks. We're leaving these hook marks in here and, and there's a myth that this somehow destroys the pole. Uh, totally untrue. Uh, the laminated pole, one of the big advantages of that is once this pole is treated, we get almost 100% penetration in the, in the treatment. So you cannot hook past a treatment line. The other major advantage, I think, to the ELAM pole is if you notice on the pole surface we have no deep checks or knots. It makes it a very safe climb. It's the same climb every day.
as you can see, the ELAM engineered laminated wood pole can be worked with conventional line tools. Attachments can be added after the pole is installed. If you have any questions about climbability and or engineering or design questions, please contact your area field representative.